Hello everyone, my name is Sylweed and welcome back to School of Dragons. Something interesting actually happened um, right now is going on in School of Dragons. I don't think I have any more quests. I really, I went around and I checked a bunch of people, Bucket, uh, Mulch, Heather, everyone here. And I couldn't find anything. The one that I have down here is Ice Storm Island, which is something I'm doing to level up because I already did a series on Ice Storm Island. Um, and I just really can't get it to make sense because I didn't even do this with the tunnel here. There should be a Whispering Death quest here. Uh, but my theory is that uh, maybe I have to level up more. I have to be higher level and then the quest comes. Uh, maybe I need to have a higher level dragon? I don't know, but I'm gonna do the Iceland Island quest. Not today, but um, very soon so that I will know for sure, okay, is there any quest left here in this whole, whole world? Because <laughs> uh, it seems kind of strange, but a maze got out. So we're gonna do that. Even though I told everyone I would not do a maze uh, on a video again, because I did so many mazes, so many mazes, and they're basically the same, but I think we're gonna do it with Pax of Pepe XXL. It's her first maze, so... We'll give it a shot. Loki's Maze of Mayhem. Halloween update too, in case you didn't notice. It's pretty dark and pretty uh, easy to notice. If you did not notice, I'm worrying that you might be blind. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. It's very dark, but I think it's cool. Alright. Loki. Same thing as last year. Same thing as every year. Oh, it's so dark. Am I the only one who sees it so freaking dark? It's freaking Sounds like Toothless, not really spooking me. Is anyone knows Toothless is from here? Toothless? Oh, I thought I heard it, I don't know what it was. Alright, that was pretty simple. Seek Thor's lightning and rain. Hmm. 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 Yes? Okay. Yeah, there we go. It was the only one because there was like two and they were colliding and that's how it looks when you know it's raining and thundering or however you would say that. Oh my goodness! That's a Titan, right? Titan whispering death. Should have called that I heard the wings flapping but I just I didn't think about it. Okay. Go, go, go before you die. You made it. Alright. Where are we? Oh my god, it's so fucking dark. Stop being so dark. Ah, crazy, it's a terrible, terrible. I almost uh, got eaten alive. Alright, and um, refracted light will reveal the path. Same as last year, I'm pretty sure. What the hell is this even? Is it paper? Um, I was just looking at it. I was not. Uh, I just wanted to look what was down in it. I didn't look. I don't even know what it was. I mean, come on. Damn it. Okay, I'll look from here then. Jeez. I don't know what that is. A lamp of some sort. Well, refracted light is something that shines through something and then re repels differently. Okay, stop falling! So sweet. So there you go. Wing! Wing! Alright, easy peasy. What's this? Oh no, not this again. Where's a spooky guy up there? What the hell is he doing? Now? Don't die, please. I like the whatever this is. It looks like plasma blast all melted off and lava. Okay, these are shaking. That's not nice. Hep, hep, and go. Well, that was easy. And make this. Oh, Geronimo. Geronimo. Okay, shut up. This ghost. Oh, don't fall. Fall, I will cry. Oh, no! God damn it! I'm gonna die with a table back up there. It's better than nothing, I guess. And so I just, I just, I click jump and she doesn't want to jump yet, so I'm going to stop and then jump, stop a little bit and then jump, so yeah, there we go. Alright, that was relatively painless. Cross by simple machines. Mm. Alright, same as, you know what, 
So this is this, this is this. And then you're probably asking yourself, how can the nail be a machine? That's absolutely ridiculous. How can the ladder be a machine? Are you completely mental? Um, but it does say simple machines. And to me, it seems that a machine is something. No, that's a rock. A machine is something you can use uh, to progress faster. It has a mechanic, so to speak. A machine mechanic, you know? So a screw is a machine because it has a mechanic that it digs into a wall or something, or a piece of wood if you're building something. A computer, maybe? Not even, well, Viking Age, not really, but a shield. Uh, I don't know, do Vikings even have screws? That seems strange. And a pulley is to pull something up, you can use it like that. A ladder gets you up, and a wheel can move things forward. It's a mechanic to make a cart go or something. Mm, very, very interesting. Um, find a path. Memory is key. Alright, compass. Uh, I mean, tracker. Tracker. Let's see if we remember this. Tracker. A mystery. The last. That's a death song cry right there. Oh my goodness. Alright, boulder. I need to stay focused. Tracker. Mystery. Boulder. Dragon Mystery Boulder. Oh, fuck. Dragon Mystery Boulder Strike. Dragon Mystery Boulder Strike. Sure. Stoker. Dragon Mystery Boulder sh 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 Strike. Sharp. Stoker title. All right, I got it. Yeah. I got it in the in the bank. I can't remember right now, but I got it in the bank. <laughs> I, I'm sure. All right. Dragon. Mystery, Boulder, Strike, Sharp, Stoker, and Title! There you go. Told you it was in the vault. Alright, let's see. Was that it? Oh, it was. Oh, I wonder what's gonna come out and attack me here. Hmm, it better not be a screaming death. Oh, what a surprise! Damn it, at least they could do another dragon. Like, how, how, how would that be? It's just so. Get damn repetitive. Okay, so you get the prize and you get this. Again. You can buy awesome stuff! So, I didn't show you guys the prize because I'm gonna show you once we get outside. Because it's. Yeah, I'm gonna say that. I guess we can open this one because it's gold. Just to get something stupid, let's just try. Let's show X, but you never get a freaking egg for coins. Come on, is that ever happened? I got a white pumpkin seeds. A white pumpkin seeds. Thanks, Gold Dragon. Oh, Shrek, it's a hard knock life. All right, now I'm gonna show you the glorious prize. Some of you probably already got it because I'm pretty late with this. I didn't think I would do it, but I did it, and yeah. <coughs> you thought it couldn't get any worse with hat and hair, but it could. Boom. You can't even see it. Oh, you, you're lucky you can't see it. That's the horror in flesh. Let's go somewhere where you can see it. Like, what the glob is that? Look at that. Oh my god, this is so terrible. Like a big green eye. Who would wear this? can't even look out there, there's no eye holes, and if there was, there was like one big one, you have to look like mm, cross-eyed to see out. Oh, damn it, Shrek. What have this become? What have we become? Freaking... Do you like me, Shrek? Yes. Do you like my nastiness? Am I attracted to you? Yes. Oh my god! Arid! Oh, Arid has saved us! Oh, how can I forget Arid? Oh my god, my dreams come true! Arid, look at me, I'm beautiful! Okay, this is not the best way to present myself to Arid, but okay. Yeah, so many quests, oh my god. He has two, but that's uh, that's enough, that's enough to make me excited. Woo! So in the last one, I recorded something, but I lost the recording. Uh, and it was Gobber, who smelled really bad. So we have to scrub him clean. So this is part two of that, I'm pretty sure. Ahoy there! 
Thanks for clearing up Gobba's stink, but now Grump has gone missing. I think he couldn't stand the smell of roses around Gobber, so he ran away. It looks like this is a job for the finest dragon wrangler alive. I'll see if I can track down old Grump while you speak with Heather. She said that she had an idea of fixing Gobble's smell. You can find her by the lab at the school. I can't wait to see what you'll come up Great with. Great timing! I just bought a fragrance oil that I, I'm calling Essence of Blacksmith. This smell is a perfect mix of old metal boot tools, suli hands, and cinched mustache, so don't be surprised if the inside of the lab smells like Gobble's smithy for a while. Uh, can you do it? We're going to need all the ingredients you got last time to make this special soap. Tallow is made from rendering. That's a pr pr procedure where you heat in pieces of animal fat so it doesn't spoil as easily. You, uh, click on the cauldron to add the block of tallow. Ew, I don't want to touch that. Why, you, why would you do this to me? That's really cool. Uh, for centuries, tallow has been used for cooking, candle making, and even in printing. Gobber uses it in his smithy as a lubricant. So his tools move smoothly when they come up against rough surfaces. Help me out. We need liquid tallow to make soap, so we need to melt this block. Could you get your dragon to light the fire underneath the cauldron? Well, Shrek doesn't really uh, have fire, but I guess we could try. Hey, are you ready for your next task? Oh, sorry, I skipped that. We need to be very careful. The dye water from Flagmas Farm is caustic, which means it can burn. Your skin, oh my god. Carefully click the cauldron to add the lye water. Oh my, why would you do this? Why would we do this? Oh, sorry, I don't know. Shrek is ang angry, I guess. Nicely done. When you pour the lye into the liquid tallow, it starts a chemical reaction. This is called saponification, which is a cool way of saying the fat in the tallow gets broken down by the sodium hydroxide from the lye water. The mixture thickens like pudding, and we have the beginning of our soap. Come on, you can do it. To finish, we need to steer the mixture of gobberize the smell and gobberize the smell. <laughs> Click on the cauldron to finish the soap. This is so disgusting. You've done a bang up job. Whoa, you can really smell the mustache. <laughs> now you'll just pour the soap into molds, and it'll be ready to use in no time. I have a quick question for you. If you click on me, okay. The mixture of tallow and lye is a chemical reaction which results in soap. What is the process called? Rendering? What? Rendering, right? No, separate, but this. She said that right? Yes! Correct! Heather looks proud. Oh my god. That's exactly <laughs> what I wanted. We did it! The bar of soap is ready and I gave it the only name that makes Here sense. You go. Now comes the hard part. Convince the goblet to actually use the soap. He still smells of rose petals and won't venture away from the waterfall. I think he's a little ashamed of smelling so sweet and fresh. Give Gobble the soap. Let's hope it's a smell he likes. He better. Oh my god, there's a soap with Gobber on it. That's so cute! Look at that! <laughs> I wonder if we can see it in the inventory. That was so adorable. <laughs> see right there, the soap! It says Gobber on it and there's two of them. That's so cute, Heather! Oh my god, Heather, you're so nice! Alright, let's give it He's by the waterfall. Oh my god, there's like rose petals flying around him, then it's Gobber. Thanks, I'm just what I needed. Gobber, so it has got a grand name and smells just like a smithy after five days smelting. I love yeah, it! If you don't mind, I need privacy to enjoy a good shower, so away with ye! <laughs> Talk to Adam on the pyre and found out he's tra tracked down my sweet group. You messed up. It's never easy to get anyone around here to clean themselves, but now the gobbler's under the waterfall, he won't come out until he's belted out every viking storm that he knows. You did a fine job there, mate. I spoke with a few vikings in work who saw Grump flying out to the open sea, but you won't have gotten far. As, as, as much as Grump hates the smell of flowers, he loves gobbler too much to go any further than that. Check out the sea stacks to find Grump and I'll let gobbler know when you find him. Alright! Oh, you found my grump? He's going to love that I smell normal again. Let me go get that overgrown sausage. My eyes. Put your clothes back on, grump. <laughs> Why would you run around burning like that? Oh my god! Well oh, alright. <laughs> Sorry about that. I don't take showers often, so I'm not well versed in the drying process. 
<laughs> procedures. Many thanks to go to Pack to Pep XXL. I couldn't have done it without that little lassie. So, same again next year. Next year. <gasps> oh, the horror gobber. Alright, I guess Grump can go home on his own when he wants to. I'm so happy that I got more quests. There's still more quests. I'm gonna do my best to get Ice Stop Island done, or at least a little bit more, so I get more level, more coins, work everything out. And uh, hopefully, I will see you in the next episode. Thank you so much once again, and so long, Dragon Rider.